Hey everyone, it's Phone Rena. Now that the iPad 2 is available, we're just going to quickly show you the iMovie application for it. It's tailor-made specifically work with the uh, tablet, and we're just going to go over some of the features that it has. And essentially at its core, it's a basic video editing software. It might not be as full-featured as the one found on Mac computers, but at least you have the ability to do it on the go with the iPad 2. So here's the interface of the iMovie application, and it's broken down to three specific panels here. On the top left here is where you import all your content, and you could switch it between videos that you've shot, also some pictures, and even some audio uh, songs on the iPad too. At the bottom here, this part is where your, your timeline goes. It shows exactly the video and all the different effects that goes into it. And the top right here is where you actually see the video play. The best thing about iMovie is it's simple and straightforward process. It doesn't take too much to actually understand how to use it. So if you want to import something, whether it be a video, we have our listing here that we already recorded. We can just click one and just uh, click the down arrow and places it in the timeline. If I want to add another one, I can also go through another one and just click it and automatically place it into position here. And you could tell where it breaks too. It shows you right there. And from here, you could add different transition effects. Now we'll just quickly show you some of the uh, different uh, theme music and also the themes that they apply on here. So when you play it, you'll see it come out like that for the first one. We could pause it. We could change it to another one here. We could do a bright and we'll see how that one looks. And it automatically will apply the, uh, the theme directly onto the, uh, to the uh, video that we've created here. So you see that. And of course, let's do a couple more here. Let's do neon. It's a little bit more flashy here. In its, uh, in its presentation. And of course you can tell by the music, it also changes it accordingly. And the last one we'll just quickly show you here is just the uh, CNN iReport one, which gives you that almost uh, live broadcast feel here. So once you've finished cutting the video to the way you want it, you could share it with a variety of different things. You could send it directly to the camera roll, so you could connect to iTunes and just download it yourself. You send it to YouTube, Facebook, Vimeo, and also CNN I report. So now we'll quickly show you what the end result looks like with what we've used. So there you go guys, so if you want to read more about iMovie, you can check out our website, phonerena.com.